Misa gotta have a drop video. I absolutely despise Jar Jar Binks, and it seems like somehow he comes out of me on a lot of videos, and I do apologize. I'm Tim. I'm Wyatt. He's my dad. That's my son. Two dudes. One truck. A million things to do. And my kid. Hey everybody, welcome back to the Positive Crunch YouTube channel. We appreciate you stopping by, as always. So, I'm not going to lie to you. I shot the opener, and I've already done the reaction and shot it. And I went back and deleted the opener, and I'm, I've got something so cool. I, it is so cool. I, and, and obviously you can read the the subject line from the video, but oh my gosh, I am so stoked for you guys and gals to see this. The master himself with a TD-50 and Roland's V-Series drums. This is going to be epic. Hey, if you're new here, Go ahead and just hit that subscribe button. Let's get to it. Y'all, I am so excited. It's been a little bit since we've actually done a drum cam video or any kind of drum video, I guess. It's probably been, what, I don't know, four or five days. <laughs> One thing you're going to get on this channel, you're going to get some, some cool drum action because we, we love drummers. I have played in back in my day and uh diddled around with a few bands and stuff uh where would i rate myself mediocre low mediocre i don't know uh, not very not this i can tell you that uh so anyway let's get to this it says roland td 50 series v drums performance by kai hato this is from the roland channel uh from 2016 Kind of leads me to believe that uh, he might not, like in most of the videos where, uh, you know, like the Roland Tama and so on videos where they're corporate sponsorship videos or trying to sell something. This leads me to believe he may not say anything that it just may be simply a performance. It's only about three minutes long. I'm excited about it. I hope that you all like it. And uh, that's all I'm going to say because it's time to see the Master Kai. A bam. Those things are so much better than the ones I used to play. <laughs> Love it.
love that overhead shot. I wish they had put more in. The, the man. The man. That was awesome. Holy cow. Holy cow. What'd you think of that? So, a little bit different than what you usually get to hear with Kai. And obviously, the drum cam videos that uh, that we react to from uh, Anti Kangashi's uh, YouTube channel and some of the other videos that we do find out there. Um, I love hearing Kai do so many different little styles and different things, yet it's his own. And I will tell you this, uh, we have messed around uh, with a kit similar to that setup. And, oh my gosh, they are super sensitive and they react so awesome. Uh, I can't say that about those TD7s that we had uh, or that I had uh, practice on back in the day. But anyway, I digress. We'll get back to Kai. Him and Daniel Erlinson from uh, Arch Enemy have to be two of the most relaxed drummers I've ever watched in my life. Uh, and when I say relaxed, they just do some of the craziest things and yet so relaxed, so fluid, and it just happens. Now, yes, they are professionals. They have been doing this for years. And it is a lot of practice time, dedication, and muscle memory. Uh, but, hey, you know, it's fun to watch. I enjoy these, especially like these um, these different uh, Roland and Tama and Pearl videos and whatever else we may find. What I find is it's cool because it's a little different than what, like I said, like in their element, what they do. There's no other ambient noises around you get the artist in their element and you get to watch them create some stuff out of thin air or stuff that has influenced them and got them to who they are where they are today as a musician and it's cool i hope that each and every one of you like this video the it seems that it, i could I'm telling you, I could put up a, not that I'm going to, but I could probably put up like a video of Kai on the toilet and it would get like a couple thousand views. Uh, Y'all weird. Don't, don't be watching that kind of stuff. Nah, I'm serious. Kai's the man. I, I am a huge fan of Kai um, and, and, and Yuka as well. I wished and, and trust me. I've had several people who who are scouring for me, uh, and I have been scouring every chance I can to try to find something that we can throw up of Yuka that is somewhat isolated. There's there's a couple videos out there where he's like setting up his drums, or and and Kai's in that video, and it's pretty cool. I did watch that one. Uh, unfortunately, the quality is really bad on it, so. We kind of elected not to put it out there. Surely there's something. Surely there's something. And one of these days, we're going to find one of those hidden gems that, for whatever reason, got no no views, or maybe it was misspelled, or, or something crazy like that. And we'll throw him up there. But for now, I hope that you enjoyed Zeka uh, as much as I did right there. I know it was a short little just demonstration performance and it was it was epic in my book for a electronic drum kit um, but we're talking about a guy who could you know grab a trash can and some cardboard boxes and probably put on a three-hour epic show so well I hope that that lifted your spirits if you're having a down day a down morning or just can't get up and get going Maybe you've had a long day and you're watching this at night and you just need something. Maybe you just want to scream. There are days when I come home and I just want to scream. And I do miss not having a drum kit around because that was a great way to take out my frustrations. 
But again, it is what it is. And we hope that you have a great day. We hope that if it hasn't been, that it will get better. Try to always do something positive. Enjoy your days. Enjoy each and every minute of your days. Okay? With that, I say thank you. And you know the next line. Stay awesome and rock on. Thanks for stopping by, everybody.